Aparna says, Namaste Father, I would like to get job completely. That's why I am here at your holy field. Show me, show me the eye which is here, let me chop it. <laughs> The eye that wants to be chopped also is mine. The eye that wants to be chopped also is mine. And let nothing remain. May it also feel like there is no I. Any concept of I you let go of. You see, because the true I is not a concept. Any sense of I, any sense of I, be thrown out. Then you discover what cannot be thrown out, ever present, conceptless, indescribable, unlabelable. Have your own darshan like this, your own darshan. You are this awareness. There is nothing that you want. You are this awareness which cannot want anything. Even love it does not want. Even joy it does not want. Peace it does not want. Nothing. And there is also nothing that you resist. It is not scared of any emotion, any appearance. Anything could happen. If this body's head is actually chopped off, it couldn't be bothered. It is not concerned. It is the eternal witnessing of everything. This one you are. Any time now, this little monkey comes and says, me, 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 what about me, me, me? You know that you cannot take it seriously. In this way, nothing can ever you. You cannot be hurt, you cannot be burnt, you cannot be seen through any senses. No picture can be made out of you. You are not young or old, you are not big or small. Both time and space give birth inside you. This pure one, beyond all concepts of purity and impurity, this one you are.
you created this universe to play this game. But nothing in the universe can actually come close to you. Therefore, as long as this universe exists, don't forget to laugh at it. Not laugh at it. Any arrogance. Just laugh at the play. Just laugh at the movie. This you are. Nothing can make you this and nothing can take this away from you because you are this. No effort, no time, nothing at all. So as long as it seems like there is a choice, then you make the choice to follow the voice of the Sadhguru. And not to go along with this stream of egoic thought. If it feels like I still have some choice, then you make this choice. Till you reach this place of pure neutrality where you see that never was there any choice because I never existed separately anyway. And this must be seen. It must not just be taken as another concept. This must be your living experience now. So don't just replace dual concepts with non-dual concepts. That alone will not help you. You must see for yourself what is it that is here now. Is it dual or non-dual? Then everything will be clear. <laughs>